It's a bit ceremonious because today's the uh, first time I'm shooting a video in this car. And to go along with it, this is... Uh, I'm back in a familiar place where I've shot a good amount of my, my most popular videos. Wow, it's... Uh, yeah, this is uh, this is amazing. Like like if this like I'm back in my office, you know. Like now, this, like this this the new office right here. <laughs> so welcome, and um, you know if this is the office, then UMBC is my office building. I still haven't healed. Years have gone by and I can't seem to figure out how to move on from my mistakes and harm that I've been dealt. Um, I don't know how or what to do to feel better or indifferent, if that's even the right way to go. But I know that I need to be better. I, I need to know and believe and trust that I can go forward without reverting to old habits reactions like I know that I want to be a better person a better family man a leader but it, it feels like uh, I take one good step forward and then it's 180 right back Unfortunately, therapy isn't much of an option at, at the moment. It's just not as accessible as I'd like it to be. I think it's good that I'm aware of it, and I think that I am working towards a solution. Originally, when I started this channel, all with good intent, I, I really always felt like I wanted to build a community, essentially. Um, give advice to people who needed it. Um, but very quickly, I, I kind of realized that I don't really have the best advice. I, I, I may have good intentions, but um, I didn't really have enough experience and advice to, to be comfortable sharing things about myself. I felt I was oversharing at times. I felt that if I exposed myself, if I put my emotions out there, if I showed how sad and, and kind of unguided I was at times, then it would bring more attention. I haven't been happy about some of my videos. Some things I've, I've taken down, some things that, um, things that I, I wish I haven't, I wish I hadn't have said. And that's kind of why I've, I've stopped doing as much as I have been. Um, just because I, I just, I don't want to keep doing what makes me uncomfortable. I, I just I just thought my good intentions would overrule the way that I felt, but essentially it just made me very uncomfortable doing this thing. I just I realized that what I don't want to do is make it seem like I'm just always in shambles. I don't I don't want to share the negative stuff, you know? If I'm if I'm gonna share anything, um, I wanna share growth and intention and possible solutions. Like I think it's totally fine to show to share that I'm going through something, but I don't wanna just show that that I'm going through something. I'd rather acknowledge that I'm going through something and come up with a solution. So this marks a shift. This marks uh, a new era for me. I want to find meaning in my struggle. I want to learn better habits, be more passionate about learning new things. I want to struggle. Like I want to I want to go through some things if it's going to make me a stronger person. So this is the solution. Until I can afford therapy, this is my new form of therapy. I think uh, the expression of my, if I, if I can learn to be more expressive um, in a proper way, in a healthy way, uh, and be productive in it, then I think that would be good. 
yeah i'm not sure still what i want this to be i just know that right now i want to create uh, i want to feel like i'm building towards something um and honestly i am i'm building toward a lot i have a lot of things in mind i want to feel confident and passionate about what i'm doing and i'm hoping that this is this is a start to something new Same as always, peace and love.